Hey Seth, my name is Stuart Briscoe and I live in the heart of the Ozarks where the views are good and the trails are even better. Growing up, I started riding bikes and motorcycles when I was five. When the bike scene started getting more popular, my brother and I started downhill riding. However, I moved away to college and I had to pay for books and tuition and I just didn't have the budget for riding. But now that I'm graduated and debt free, I have a job and I'm ready to get back into riding. I had to relearn most of my skills, which was pretty rough, but I'm improving well. Here we're at the hardest of the jump circuit. This place is always a mental block to me because of how many times I've wrecked. We're gonna try it again today, see how we do. Riding here is focused on cross country and free riding, something my 2001 Jackal is not suited for. Even though I can do a little bit of everything on this bike since I added this 90 s sprocket to it, if I'm going to get serious about trail riding, I'm going to need an upgrade. My friend John manages a channel that showcases the outdoors, and one of its major goals is advertising the great trails and bike parks of the Ozarks. And there are many ranging from the rail yard, the back 40, Kohler, and two rivers. And we want to cover them all in depth. And having a bike such as yours, your full suspension, would make filming these areas an actual possibility. Our most important goal when making these videos is to get people into riding. And with the spare bike, we could even dedicate entire videos to taking a new person riding or somewhere that's into BMX and doesn't have a, a bike capable of a trail. We could introduce them into it and pull more people into the biking community. I would even like to get my own wife into riding. Since she is the same height as I am, I'd like to get my whole family started just like how I used to with my dad and my brother. I know you're concerned about the upkeep of the bike, as you should be, and that's no problem for me because I have kept this used 7 year old bike maintained really well, and it's from doing weekly things such as rinsing it down, regreasing the bike, and I have to give a big thanks to my local downhill bike shop for more major repairs. And this bike would be a brand new bike from my standpoint, and I would treat it like a new one. On a final note, Seth. I saw your IMBA event video showcasing the Ozark Trails, and it was an impressive video, and if you would like to do a collaboration with us at places you have not been to, please let us know. And to anyone else out there watching the video that lives in the Ozark and wants to give writing a try, drop us a comment in the video and maybe we can set something up. 
because it's all about giving back to the riding community. So thanks for watching, everyone. Now get out there and ride.